What is up, my drunky buddies? It's me, Michael B. Riker. We're going to do something a little different tonight. Tonight, we are not going to play Halo Master Chief Collection. Tonight, we are going to be playing Metal Gear Solid 5. Now, I've had this on my hard drive when I first got my Xbox, and I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, what the heck is this? Because I've never done anything like it. I've always done, you know, the Splinter Cell one. I've always done Splinter Cell, and Metal Gear Cell is apparently the rival for it, so I figured, you know what, what the heck, let me see what this is about. So, if anybody would, yes I do realize that, if anybody would like to give me a hand out about what Metal Gear Solid is, I would greatly appreciate it, because I haven't got a clue what the heck half this stuff is anyways. Without further ado, <laughs> all right, checking data. I didn't get far in the first mission, so <laughs> this should be interesting. I right, continue. Actually, let's. Start over for people who have. Yes, I do realize it would erase the data. But let's start over for the people who are just joining us. Oh, this is, uh, hints. Okay, then. Man, the graphics are incredible on here. I mean, I've heard that the graphics on here are always incredible. Not just the Xbox One, but Konami. Now, I've played Konami games before, but this... this is incredible. <laughs> Mag-10. Submachine gun, 9mm. Go through an entire stick of mag, which is about 45 rounds, if I remember correctly, in under two seconds. He told us everything. Don't worry, I kept my word. He didn't suffer long. Uh, did I miss something? Because you earned it. I feel like I did. Wait, that kid's got headphones on, and he's he's got the headphone port in his chest. How's it feel to play the traitor? That's a feel for me to shove my boot up no your butt. War games. You're a real man now, soldier. Give 
my regards to your boss when you get home. So, if I'm reading this correct, this is based in the mid to late 70s. Oh, cool, they actually have real music in here. Oh, come on. Couldn't they have played something a little bit better than something like this? I mean, this sounds like a drinking song they play in a Russian bar. Ten days ago, we got reports that possible. Elysian fishing are the drifting in the Caribbean. So what's the plan? Silence her before we're compromised? No. I've got something else in mind. Our friends at Cypher suspect Pass could be a double agent. She's being held for interrogation at a camp on the southern tip of Cuba. Black site. Nice. A slice of American pie on communist soil, and out of U.S. legal jurisdiction. The upcoming inspection of Mother Base has to be connected somehow. The timing's too perfect. The U.N.'s nuclear inspection. My guess is they're trying to corroborate Pass's link. We're an army without a nation. Word of our capabilities gets out, and we'll have the whole world out to shut us down. Having an American private Ooh, intelligence a Black Hawk chopper. Is bad news. Cypher's the one. Uh, Swarovski Black Hawk. She knows the truth. Sorry. I, uh... <laughs> hey, check it out. That's Fox spelled backwards. We need her on our side. I know. I'm staying the obvious. I know. I, I've worked an eight and a half hour shift today at work. I'm a little tired. <laughs> XOF. Okay, that's high tech for the 70s. Skull face. Identity unknown. Oh, good God. What the, what the hell happened to him? Gotta go this way, guys. This way. <laughs> so who's the other target? That would be Chico. He's being held in the same area as Pass. Last radio contact was 40 hours ago. Find them both. All right, guys. Bring let's alive. bring all your badges. Take them off. Come on. Hand them over. Secure we can't let anybody know who we are. Okay, I'll be honest, that is cool. We'll send a chopper from across the Cuban border. You should be back at Mother Base in time for lunch. You'll probably just miss our guests. The only catch is you go in solo. 
The politically sensitive nature of the mission means backup is not an option. Huh. Fine. I like some of course. time now and then. Robin acting down and Terror Strong. I've heard both of them. Uh Robin has done um uh voiceovers like the Abomination and Hulks and Smashers. Terror Strong's done like um like Batgirl. And um she's done like a, a ton of voiceovers. Both of them have. Kiefer Sutherland. Hey, Kiefer, you're a pirate. <laughs> okay. This shouldn't be too hard. If it's anything like Splinter Cell, it should be up there with the Really good and holy crap. What the? Chico and Paz are being held in an old, unused part of the compound. Get inside and head northeast. Um, okay. Mission info has been updated. This is an infiltration mission. You've got to stay out of sight. Before you go any further, use your binoculars to recon the area. Oops. What do you see? Press the call button to get more intel. There's a door in the fence. Ah, uh, duh. There we go. It's a guard. Don't let uh. him see you. Avoid combat whenever possible. <laughs> it's a guard. Well... You think? Definitely not the ice cream man. Another one. Wait. Thought I heard something. Hey, is this the game where you, um, if you walk by a terrace, they make that little noise and the exclamation point goes over your head? Because, oh, I think it is. Okay, how do I get in? Wonder if I can go this way. I'll be honest with you guys, this is my first playthrough, so if I fail a lot, it's because I have no idea what the heck I'm doing. Just like in uh, Ghost Recon. Headshot. That's not a pot shot at Apple. Marker placed. You know, this is a lot of technology for, you know, the mid to late 70s. 